When you want to travel in style to see everything gorgeous around our country, you got to be thinking about a Thor motorhome. Thor is numero uno in motorhomes, and the Class A Windsport is a good reason why. The Windsport line has a great set of floor plans for you to choose from. Now, I'm certainly going to get to those, but first, what do you say we dig into some features that make a Windsport so easy to love? When you step inside of a Windsport and the first word popping out of my yam is wow, super classy class A, right? Let's head to the cab area first. You'll get a very modern dash radio with a large 10 inch touchscreen, Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, Bluetooth, and Sirius XM ready. The screen can display your backup monitor and the side cameras. By the way, those side cameras are heated and have remote exterior mirrors. Love that. On the steering wheel, you have control of the audio as well as the cameras, so you don't have to reach over and touch the dash. Nice, right? Well, captain's chairs up front swivel around so you can join in the conversation in the campground, not on the road. You can also take a glance in the conversation mirrors uh, on the front overhead cabinets if you want to, but once again, pay attention to the road. Not sure why they call them conversation mirrors though, as you should be keeping your thoughts and eyes on the road, but I didn't create it. There's also the handy stowaway coffee table. It sits right between the captain's chairs, but you have cup holders for when you're driving. And look, the passenger can actually do some work while driving as well. They may not want to, but at this point with the setup, you got a pull out workstation that includes a 110 and 12 volt outlet on it. This dash workstation on the passenger side also has WineGuard Connect that works as a router hotspot and TV antenna. So voila, work and entertainment. Speaking of entertainment, it continues in the main cabin where you'll get a large flat screen TV with a Blu-ray player. You'll also have an HDMI video distribution system. Every Windsport is cable TV ready and has a digital TV antenna as well as a satellite mounting bracket on the roof. FYI, a Windsport bunkhouse model will also have TV prep tablet holder, and USB charge port in each bunk. And where are you gonna watch TV from? Well, via from the super comfy furniture. Uh -huh. You get a dream dinette booth with cup holders and a leatherette sofa or theater seats with integrated footrests. Plus, certain Windsport models also include an electric fireplace with remote control. Man, talk about relaxation. Uh, that dream dinette comes with a wireless phone charger with USB plug on its tabletop, and there's a single child safety tether for traveling. Regarding USB charging outlets, they're all over the place to make it easy to keep your phone at 100%. And look how roomy the living area is, including a whopping 84 inches of interior height, good for nearly 100% of the average American and probably 70% of NBA players. When traveling, you'll want a good kitchen, and the Windsport, it has one. You'll get a double door, 12 cubic foot residential fridge, depending upon the model. Three burner gas cooktop with bifold glass cover, 30 inch over the range microwave, solid surface countertop with LED accent lighting, and a double bowl stainless steel sink with a pull down sprayer faucet. All of the drawers have full extension ball bearing drawer guides. Some models also come with a full length pull out pantry and all come with a decorative glass and tile backsplash for when you splatter the marinara. Splatters can also reach the floor, which is a good reason wind sports have residential vinyl flooring for easy cleanup. Splatters probably, we only hope anyway, won't reach the ceiling, but just look up for a second. That's a ceiling ducted AC system with a big blower. For longer Windsport models, you'll get another AC unit right in the bedroom, which is, dare I say, cool. <laughs> Knee slapper. Speaking of the bedroom, let's stroll into the boudoir. A Windsport bedroom has a king bed with handy outlets for CPAP machine, plenty of storage, plus a pretty sweet 32 inch TV. There you go. And by the way, when it is sleepy time, you have pull down privacy shades all over the place. Privacy curtains on the cab side window and a power privacy shade 
for the windshield. Also, over the cab, in case you missed it, which I probably did, you get a drop down overhead bunk with a very comfy cotton cloud mattress. Seriously, it's like sleeping on a cloud if you're an angel, which I've never been accused of. We skipped the bathroom only because I just love that king size bed, but now let's talk a little bit about the bathroom. You're going to get a nice laminated countertop, sizable shower with a skylight and a glass door, plus a linen closet. Other great interior features, you get the Rapid Camp plus Multiplex system to control lights, slide outs, monitor tank levels, and a whole lot more on one touch screen, which is huge. Or you can do it straight off the app on your tablet or smartphone. Oh, technology, man. Some Windsport models will have washer dryer prep, which is a nice touch. We also can't forget about how nice it is to have automatic headlights as well as an automatic generator start for the Onan gas generator standard on every Windsport. Plus, there is a gen start switch on the dash. The generator, of course, is accessible via the exterior, and that is where I'm going to head right now. The Windsport is built on an F53 chassis, which means you're going to get the horsepower you need to tow your car. You'll get an 8,000 pound trailer hitch with a seven pin connector. Now in the rear of the Windsport, you may notice a roof ladder, which is handy, but I'm really thinking about that exterior kitchen with a beverage fridge and a sink. Can't tell you how many units do not have the sink. Not coincidentally, right beside it is the external propane connection. Cook outdoors, yet still stay protected via the very large awning. The slides also have awning toppers as well. You know what else sits under the power awning? How about some entertainment? You got a 32 inch TV on a swivel with a Bluetooth soundbar. It's also good to note that your pup can also be under the awning. You'll get the pet link multi-purpose tie down so your little arf arf can nap nap way better than putting your pup into a storage compartment. Yes, I know they certainly can fit sometimes. I mean, just look at the room in the basement pass-through storage, the Rotocast storage compartments, and those bays, huge. But be nice to your furry friend. Heck, you can even give them a nice cleaning via the outdoor shower or yourself, which you should be nice to as well. Not with the shower, you got one on the inside, remember? Just as a mental note, be nice to yourself. A wind sport makes it easy to level with automatic leveling jacks, plus makes it easy to save power. You'll get a battery disconnect switch and every wind sport has solar prep with a solar power controller and a great option, a solar charging system. This 100 watt solar panel can keep you boondocking just a little bit longer. A quick note about construction. You want your class A to last and a wind sport is certainly built to do that. You're going to get a welded tubular steel floor plus welded tubular aluminum roof and sidewall cage construction. The roof is also a premium one piece, as are the fiberglass front and rear caps. The whole Megillah is vacuum bonded, laminated roof walls and floor plus block foam insulation really helps keep the temperature where you want it. I've picked out a few select Windsport floor plans, uh, so let's say we check them out, and I'm going to do it by length if that's okay. They're all going to be from about 31 feet to a bit over 37 feet, so all within the same range, so to speak. The 29M has a roomy bedroom with a king size bed, ample closet space, can sleep up to six, plus has a very sweet exterior kitchen with the sink and beverage fridge. Seriously, I can't tell you how many RVs out there don't come with that sink. The 34J has a wall slide, pulling out the entire driver's side from the cab to the rear. There's a roomy bedroom with a king size bed. The 34J is a bunkhouse model, so you'll get twin bunks in the wall slide, plus TV prep for the bunks, as well as USB charging ports and a tablet holder. Since those bunks are present, the 34J can sleep up to eight. Rare for the Class A gas segment, the 35M is a bath and a half floor plan with a full rear bath in the back so you can create a master bedroom suite. The king bed is in its own slide to create a ton of room. In the living area, you'll find the half bath, large TV at an angle facing the sitting areas that are in a slide out. And the 35M can sleep up to seven. You know you want to jump into a Class A motorhome and see the sights around the country or else you wouldn't have gotten this deep into the video. By the way, thank you. 
a Thor Wind Sport can take you wherever you want to go, tow the car you want to take with you, and give you ample floor plans to choose from. To find your Wind Sport, head on over to rv.campingworld.com.